<laughs> it's so hard, guys. It's so hard. Hey, and today we are going to another movie by Mel Gibson and this is Huxo Ridge. As you remember, I only reacted to another film by Mel Gibson and I was quite surprised. And this is Apocalypse 2. I was quite surprised to see such an interesting and beautiful environment of Meyer. You know, I was feeling like I'm here, I could hear the smells. It's fantastic how he's working on some projects. That's why I can't wait to see another one and this is Huxo Ridge. As we already know something about this war, this film focused on the World War II. It took place in Australia from September to December 2015. As we know, the Second World War was based on Europe and some Japanese soldiers were involved in this process by Nazi side. If you're ready to cry, please keep watching. And if you're new here, hello guys, I'm so glad that you're here. Thank you for clicking this video. Make sure that you subscribe to my channel, then we can get more videos in the future. Also, you can take a look at the full movie reaction with me on my Patreon page and you can see a bunch of movies in the future and already released other movies on my Patreon page and blocked video as well. So let's go into it. I'm quite excited. Ooh. Oh my gosh. And this music is touching my heart. A little bit Scottish shadows. Have you not heard? The Lord is the everlasting God, creator of the ends of the earth. He will not grow tired or weary. In his understanding, no one can fathom. Even youths grow tired and weary, but those who hope in the Lord will renew their strength. They will soar on wings like eagles. Poor people trying to save his life. Don't sleep, don't sleep. This is you. What? Catch her. Beat up. I got something to tell you. Where's she to be talk? Cheater. Hey, cheater. My goodness, look at the beautiful atmosphere in this environment. Be careful. Ooh, wow. Crazy as their old man. What's happened to your friend? They dug up the corner of Jackson and Maine. Oh my gosh, hello! I love this actor. You boys wouldn't recognize it now. Mind you, I doubt they'd recognize you. They hardly know me when I walk by. It's like I died with you. Who is that? It's like we boys never existed. Well, that's all I got for you today. <coughs> Oh, of course not this boy, it's his father. I got it. What's going on? Guys, stop fighting. He didn't stop them at all. Look at that. Lock him with your right. Stop it. What are they fighting about? Now, when they ever need a read, the way I just whip the one that wins. Please, 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 careful, guys. What's going on? Huh? No! It's not okay at all. What are you doing? Mom, wake up. Can you hear me? The hell are you doing? You can't hear me. It's my breathing should love them fighting like that it's so hard it's not joke at all what's going on oh my god oh, i can imagine what he's feeling now this boy it's only fighting and it was like an impulse right yes man Tom, stop. He's violent enough already. You tell him the world's a soft and gentle place. Hell's gonna be okay. He's alive? What's happened to your brother? Tell me. I could have killed him. Yes, you could have. Murder, it's the worst sin of all. That is the most egregious sin in the world, sir. Nothing hurts his heart so much. The father definitely has some problems. I hate him. Their relationship in this family, you know, it's really bad, and especially for boys. Mama, why does he hate us so much? He don't hate us, he hates himself. Your daddy tonight, that ain't the real him. I wish you knew him like I did before the war. 
You know, I'm happy that this boy is alive, guys, because, oh my gosh, his brother could get some trauma to the rest of his life. <laughs> How do we sound, Desmond? When we host angels, Mom. It's a sin to tell a lie. Well, I never said they were saying an angel. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh, what's happening? Get it out, get it out. Oh. Drag him out. Just talk. Good for you that you know what to do. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Joshua, pick you up. should type. <laughs> Yes, 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 good idea. You're gonna be fine now, you're gonna be fine. There you go. Quirk, you might have saved this boy's life. Staying with us? You're gonna be okay. Yes, you saved his life. Yeah, certainly. I think it's such a wonderful feeling, am I right? When you do something good for another people. Okay, he found the girl. Oh yes, she's beautiful. Army physicals that way. This is for giving blood. Oh no, that's not mine. Thank you for asking, though, ma'am. What do you need? My belt. I lent it to the boy who had the, had the accident. I don't have your belt. It's out there. It's right out there with the boys. I'm just here to take blood. I'll give you mine. I go to that room over there and wait with the others. Is it okay without any testing? You wanna take his blood? That that room. My friends call me Desmond. No, ma'am, my first time. I always dreamed about being a doctor, but uh, didn't get much school. Might be a little dizzy when we're done. Somebody picking you up? No, ma'am, walking back five or six miles. I cut through the woods seven that way. He's such a specific smile, and his face is unique. I really interesting in his facial features, and like to observe how he's acting, how he's talking to her. You okay? Met someone yesterday. Her name's Dorothy Shooty. I'm gonna marry her. Yeah, it's about to. You ever even spoken to a woman? Oh, his father's back. And your brother. Great to see you all together. Come give your brother a big hug. Oh, big Reese, hug. Me. Good luck. Oh, it's answering. Grab a seat. Ever given blood before? Yes, ma'am, I have. His voice. You're the belt man. Well, Desmond, we can't take your blood two days in a row. Time to get mine back. My blood needed back. Well, it don't work like that. We can't just give it back to you. Ever since you stubbed me with that needle, my heart's been beating real fast. Every oh. time I think about you, it beats faster still. Pretty corny. That's a shame. I, I don't practice that all night. <laughs> Such a cursed boy, guys. I didn't say that. He's staring at her all the time. It's a little bit uncomfortable situation. What's the difference between an artery and a vein? What are you talking about? The, the boy's accident. Arteries spur blood. And veins? Bleed. All these people are kissing around. Look at that. Another medical question, perhaps? Prettiest thing that I've ever seen. That's because I'm sitting in the dark. You're just beautiful. He's right. He's right. I agree with you. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't think you'd mind. You didn't ask. Well, I might have if you'd asked. She's right. She's right. <laughs> you coming? <laughs> What's going on here? Oh no, your brother. Look at the father's face. He didn't expect it. He didn't know about that. And mom? Why didn't you say nothing to us? What about his commandment? It's not killing in a war. And they need men. Working in a paper mill ain't gonna save this country. It looks like a movie star. Nice uniform. Reminds me of how Artie Gittins looked in his uniform when we went to France. Don't talk. What? I'm just saying how snappy Artie looked in his uniform. He had them flocking to him he was most proud. I just hope that when our Hal gets shot, it's through the front of his jacket. Artie got hit in the back. That's an intestines out his front. Awful everywhere. It's so painful for him, yeah? To see his boy wearing this uniform. It was lucky he was dead, so he never knew how. Get out of my sight. No, this part just a little bit reminded me of the Patriot. Maybe. Do you remember? The eldest son, without any permission, left his house and joined the army. How old is he? I mean, uh, the character. 
Oh yes, this is the place. What are you, part mountain goat? Are you gonna help me, Desmond Doss? Are you just gonna leave me stranded? <laughs> she can't climb like you. <laughs> but it's gonna cost you. What? A kiss. <laughs> but that is still my condition. <gasps> she's okay, she's okay. I'm gonna hold you to it. <sighs> oh wow. Oh, hold on now. You ain't gonna slap me, are you? Kiss me and find out. Mmm, guys, such a romantic place, and it's beyond belief. <laughs> what? I have to enlist. Yes, you can. Dorothy, you can stay here. I have. I won't be a medic. I figure I'll be saving people, not killing them. I have to go to work. I'm gonna be late. Oh, of course he doesn't want to hear it. Dorothy, Dorothy. So, are you gonna ask me to marry you or what? <gasps> oh. Are you gonna ask me or marry or what? <laughs> With all my heart and this, will you marry me? Yes, I will. Oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> I didn't think about it at all because of this news. Oh my gosh. When? Did you get your first leave? Still don't like you at this moment. Okay. Okay, well, I love you. Mmm, it's so sad and so great and ah. Uh, Kind of mix of feelings. Mama said, come see you here. These three were my best friends. I grew up with them. I got into trouble with them, chased girls with them. Now my friends are there, working grass and eaten by worms. I don't want to have to visit my sons here. Daddy, I, I signed up already. Everybody else is, is doing it. everybody else. Damn it, it, fools we were. You know, and soldiers who live, they live because they can do that. You can't. You got to sit and think and pray about everything. Look at you. You're doing it right now. No, I won't be able to live with myself if I don't. I'm going to be a medic. There you go, thinking it all out. Did you figure this war is just going to fit in with you? To be a medic, I guess he needs to pass some exams or some tests or something like that. I don't know, honestly. Miracle chance you survived won't be given no thanks to God. I've got you. Now say goodbye to Mama. Oh. Lady, come on. I almost forgot. I want you to have this. It's mine. You keep it right here where I'll be. Bye. Oh my goodness. It's so sad to see them saying goodbye. I love you. <laughs> oh yes. This is her photo. <laughs> Always interesting to observe the situation, especially. Gaze upon it in envy, my friend. You can see right here. I've used the mountains down to the lake. Randall Fuller. Desmond Dahl. Call him teach. It's because no one else here can read. Man calling himself Hollywood. Of course, look at his body, look at his chest. Oh, hey, I just got this shit. Hey, uh, Nolan, out of Red Hook, where are you from? Paul Kaczynski, nice to meet you. What did you say your name was? Desmond Dawes. Thinks he's some kind of cowboy. He may be small, but he is a bulldog. Yeah. Desmond, yeah. Uh, Lucky Ford? Hey. Hand in their card shot. No, pipe down, Greaser, right? Oh, hey. Good book, right? I, I think, uh, I think Lucky's got a good book, right? Lucky's a good read. And shot! Let's go! Move! He's naked, guys. You are a very strange-looking individual. Name? Andy Walker. Sir? I am not, sir! I am Sergeant Howe or sir! The name is Ghoul, you say? Walker. Sergeant! Oh, it is! Yes, Sergeant! <sighs> Poof. What about you? Oh my gosh, he's in pain. An off in your presentation, Private. Is it your hair? Wrinkle in your trousers. I have a knife in my foot, Sergeant. Oh, yes. I have a knife in my foot, Sergeant. Spitty Riker. No, Private. Idiot. Who threw the knife. Private Krasinski. You look part Indian. I believe you must have Cherokee or Shawnee. Addicting me! Let me see your Indian war cry, son! <laughs> <laughs> you really dead. So, because of the game, I guess. Ah, what is your animal spirit? <laughs> Are you a chipmunk? No, Sergeant! Right now! No, Sergeant! No, Sergeant! Run. <laughs> Screaming at their faces. Like, so clothe each other. Then I shall henceforth call you Chief. Thank you, Sergeant! Are you grinning at me, boy, or is that your natural name, Private? Desmond Dog. I have seen stocks of corn with better physiques. Can you carry your weight? Yes, Sergeant. Should be easy for you. Make sure you keep this man away from strong winds. Private idiot. Higher. <laughs> Everyone outside, now. What about his food? I said move it. No, you don't have any time. I believe any man who takes such pride in his natural naked state surely enjoy the brisk of the out. Move your privates. Private part. Go without any pants. Go. Son of an exhibitionist. <gasps> I'm teach you how to tie a bowline knot, so I may then kick them. Great a loop. Rabbit comes out of his hole, goes back into the hole. All right? 
Very good, Tex. Have you ever roped a goat, Hollywood? No, Sarge. No, Sarge. Good, that would be unnatural. Good, private idiot. Congratulations, Greaseball. You just fell 50 feet and broke your neck. Private Vito Vanelli. You strangled yourself, numb. If you're American, you'd be taller. What do we got here, Doss? One for each titty. You were tying a bowline, boy, not building a bra. <laughs> what is so funny, Corporal? Couldn't tell you, Sergeant. No, Come on! A little hustle! This is his first day. Can you imagine his feelings? Oh my gosh, he's still naked. Oh my gosh, without any pants. <laughs> Wow. No, what are you doing? It's not fair. What's wrong with you? I thought you all together, guys. He's first. Good job. This is a personal gift from the United Caliber 30. M1, shoulder fired semi automatic in destruction to the enemy. This is to be your lover, the only thing in life you'll ever truly love. Fellas, let's dance. Don't point your gun forward. No matter how much you are tempted, place the weapon by your side. He doesn't want to take any weapon at all. Problem, Private Cornstalk. Is there not one in your side? No, sorry. I was, I was told I don't have to carry a weapon. Come again, step forward, Private. I can't be here in this room. Well, I'm sorry, Sergeant. I can't touch a gun. Well, what happened to him? Exactly the problem. Problem, just a mistake. Told the army when I when I joined up. Do you know why it's not possible, Private? Because the United States Army does not make mistakes. There's a problem. You must be that problem. He's a CO, sir. It's wrong battalion, am I right? And you joined the army. Well, no, sir. I'm, I'm a conscientious cooperator. You're screwing with me, Doc. Sir, I volunteered. Wearing my uniform, a salute and flag, and just carrying a gun and taking a human life. She don't kill, that's all? Yes, sir, that's all. I mean, that is the essential nature of war. Do you have any other requirements of the United States Army? He's talking to him so nice and sweet. I think something is expecting him in the future. Saturday is my Sabbath. It's not allowed to work. Problem, do you, Sergeant? We should simply ask the enemy not to invade on the Sabbath. <sighs> of course not. Well, now we got that clear. Now let me tell you my requirement. Complicated as yours is very simple. As long as you're in this company, you will obey my orders, period. If you can't do it here, I can't trust you to do it in battle. I'm putting you in for a Section 8 psychiatric discharge. Dismissed. Dismissed. I want you to meet Private Desmond Doss. Private Doss does not believe in violence. He does not practice violence. He will not even deign to touch a weapon. See, Private Doss, conscientious objective. Anyway, he could learn how to use this weapon for his own safety. Be too busy wrestling with his conscience. That's not Private, true, Sarge. As you work. Now, I realize some of you might have strong feelings about this. It is what we men fight for. Even if Private Doss's belief might cause women and children to die. To give Private Doss the full measure of respect he is due. Am I clear? Yes, yes Sergeant! Oh, wow. What are these things you about? Here, does he? You know what that is? It just seems kind of small. It's half the Bible for half the man. Bible. I don't remember speaking to you. Please don't touch him, okay? It's not your business at all. How come you don't fight? You think you're better than us? But what if you was attacked? Huh. Say it like that. Bible says to turn the other cheek, don't it? Oh, do you remember the fighting with the brother? I think this is cowardice. Is that right, Doss? You chicken shit, that eh? Take a poke! Okay, well, I'm gonna give you a free shot. Right there. Please, stop! No? What is this? Ooh. Now, this would be the kind of broad that deserves a real man. Please give it back, Smitty. Please give it back, Smitty. What are you doing? Come on. Stop being an asshole, come on! Do you hear voices, Desmond? No, sir. Sir, I'm not a crazy person. What's wrong with you guys? Believing in God, it's okay. I'm not gonna pretend to be something I'm not. You lonely? So you don't hear voices? I pray to God and I, it ain't a conversation. Well, yes, sir. I know all you really wanna do is give me a section eight, draw me out of the army, but... Why are you asking such a weird question? Simply believe what I believe. Well, I'm trying to understand. Was it, was it God who told you not to pick up a rifle? Not to kill. Most people take that to mean don't commit murder. Completely different set of circumstances. A new commandment I give unto you, that you love one another. This is Satan himself, we're fighting. Good Christian, you can see that. Why I joined up. But I'm sorry, I will not bear arms. But they do not constitute grounds for Section 8 discharge. How am I supposed to maintain discipline with a man? Oh my god. Yes, they need all the discipline. Be allowed to work as a combat medic, provided he qualifies. Perhaps we could. Yeah, you restrict him to barracks and KP. I want him gone. It really makes sense, guys. Gosh, your area is a It's a pig style! Got some shit on your mind! No sword! Would you men feel to recognize it's no better than its weakest member? Now to help you learn that lesson, there will be no passes this week. Everybody in full gear for a 20-mile hike. Let's go! 
my gosh, can you hear his voice? Let's go. Don't start feeling sorry for yourself. You dogs don't know what tired is. Oh my gosh, cause of him, cause of him. <laughs> Try to sleep in. Get off me. Okay, get off. Why the hell are you still here? <sighs> I'm so sorry, boy. As you were. Where's Doss? Right in the face. You knew. This isn't good for anybody. I mean, what I joined up for. It's not about what you joined up for. It's about the lives of every man in your son. Time you quit this. Finish getting dressed and I'll walk you down. It's okay, Doss. There's no shame in this. Today I'm on KP this morning, so can't. I think this boy's gonna hear him now. All right, Doss. Can you identify the men that beat you? I don't think so. No, Sarge. Are you saying that you don't know who attacked? I never said I was attacked, Sarge. You bruised half your body sleeping. I, I sleep pretty hard. Doesn't want to tell you. <laughs> don't want anyone coming back pissing cream. It's a bit tough, guys. Of course, of course. They need more discipline, all of them, just to make sure they can cover each other. Private dog. Yes, this is a furlough for men who have passed the basic training. Why? No, sir. Res respectfully, sir, I have. I, I put in for this further three weeks ago. I'm getting married. This afternoon. Rifle qualified. Well, I'm not required to carry a rifle, sir. But Colonel, Colonel Stella. His determination was provided he qualifies in all other areas of his training. Oh, my God. Pretty clear. Show me you know how to handle a rifle, and I'll sign your hand private DOS, your firearm. She doesn't want to touch this rifle at all. I won't touch a rifle, sir. That is a direct order from a company commander! You stop this nonsense and quit. And I will have no recourse but to court-martial you the duration of the war in a military prison. I can, sir. Oh my gosh, she's waiting for him. She can't. Oh, Blue, she's waiting for him now here. How much longer would you like to wait, Dorothy? I think it's been long enough. Sometimes men just get cold feet. Not my Desmond. He's in the prison. <laughs> oh no! I don't know, maybe I'm gonna argue, but I think this is a beautiful idea, you know, to help some people to save their lives without touching the rifle. Of course. You probably think I'm a real son of a cares only about regulations and not his man. Aye, aye. I believe in this book as much as any man. You do when everything you value in this world is under attack. I don't know, sir. I ain't got answers to questions that big. I don't give a rat's ass about your principles because the Japs don't. Hit him with your Bible. I'm prepared to give my life for my men. I'm only here because I don't want to see you rotting in a prison cell. Plead guilty. Maybe they'll let you go home and pray. Let the brave men out there go and win this war. All these people feeling sorry, but they can't say yes. If I can't convince you, maybe she can. They wouldn't let me call you. What have they done to you? That's okay, I'm all right. They're saying you could go to prison, Desmond, Leavenworth. There must be some other way. I've done everything they asked me except this one thing. I'm being treated like... Nobody can say you did. Who are you gonna save in prison? And why can't you just pick up the stupid gun and wave it around? You don't have to use it, just meet them halfway. But I can't do that. Yes, you can, it's just pride. Don't confuse your will with the Lord. Look at the eyes. Oh no, oh no. Maybe I'm prideful. But I don't know how I'm gonna live with myself, much less how you could live never be the man that I want to be in your eyes. I fell in love with you because you were like anyone else. Do not think that you'll disappoint me. I will love you no matter what. Mm, this is really important for him and especially here to hear these words. Oh my god. I don't know what he's gonna do. But then he'll get a dishonorable discharge. Either way, they'll call him a coward and I don't see how he can live with that. Well, thank you, Dorothy. Tell him that we love him and that we're praying for him. We're praying for both. Bye-bye. Do you want to say something, Father? He still remember this conversation, his mom and daddy in his childhood. Oh, it's a late moment. He's ready to kill his wife. I wish to speak to Brigadier General Musgrove. It'd be quite impossible. Corporal Thomas Doss would appreciate a brief word. He's in a very important meeting. He was my captain. It's it's most vital. Amen. <laughs> 
charge is disobeying a series of direct orders from me. He wishes to enter a not guilty plea. Is that so, Private? I thought this was a... Yes, sir, but I changed my mind. You wish to proceed to a court-martial? Yes, sir. Yeah. Proceed. Your Honor. It does work like that, I guess, right? ...waves his morality at us like it's some kind of badge of honor by directly disobeying a series of direct orders from his commanding officer. I'm gonna nail him. Mm, good prepared for this speech and... You know what to say. Are they still deliberating? Okay, now you go take this in. There. They're fixing to bury him. This letter directly to the judge. You can do that, girl. Deny disobeying Colonel Sangston's direct orders. Well, do you, Private? No, sir, I don't. Why are you contesting it then? Why is it so important to you, given your refusal to even touch a weapon? When the Japanese attacked Pearl Harbor, I took it personal. There were two men in my hometown, cleared 4F unfit. They killed themselves because they couldn't serve. I, I had a job in a defense plan. I could have taken a deferment that I would just be sitting at home safe. I need to serve. I got the energy and the passion to serve as a med. While everybody else is taking life, I'm going to be saving it. He's choosing another job. The world so set on tearing itself apart, I want to put a little bit of it back together. Hmm. Sounds impressive. Why not? Why not, guys? Say okay, okay. I have information. Laudable. The facts of the charge seem it. What the hell is going on? Let him go. Dad. That's a great war uniform. Show you this. With respect, sir, you are unable to attend this hearing. I'm sorry. You fight for your country, you... and then you're done with. You were at least twice decorated. I see, sir. Sir, I know the law, and I know my son is. They're why I went and fought to protect them. But then I have no idea what the hell I was doing there, sir. Thank you, Corporal Dust. Let me have the letter. All right. I hope you're gonna read it now. You must go. The defendant's rights as a conscientious objector are protected by an act of Congress. That includes, in this case, he's disobeying orders to bear arms. I'm Brigadier General Musgrove. General. I withdraw the charges. You are free to run into the hellfire of battle. Single weapon to protect yourself. And begin training as a combat medic. Oh, yes! Thanks! <laughs> I begged him to stay. I, I told him you'd want to see When you get home, you tell him I love him. I'm interesting in his brother's life. Oh my gosh, his face looks like a child face. He's smiling so free and... Mm. Oh my gosh, dead people. Ninety-six. These are the guys we're replacing. Seems good to me. Who's cool? I had seen a training for this medic, some medical training. Captain Glover, Lieutenant Manville, 96. We've been assigned you, sir. Let's get these men some gel. Sir, who's Das? You Das? How do you know that you have Das? Sir. You and me are about the only medics we got left in this area, so. You just come off the line. What's it like? I said, what's it like? Hacksaw. We climbed up six times. Six times they threw us off. Last time there wasn't anything left of the 96. They're animals. Nips don't care if they live or die. They keep coming at you. And they ain't never gonna give up. The Japs deliberately target the wounded. Lose all your Red Cross markings. Yeah, they can shoot you quickly. Here, I got you a new helmet. One size fits all. Axel Rick! Maybe we get Okinawa! Pals in the Navy are gonna soften them up for us. Okay, now, boy, you can hear the real sound of the weapons. <sighs> Nobody can survive that. <laughs> oh, yes. These bunkers here, here, and here. Is that accurate? They're <laughs> sweet. He's sick, he's feeling unwell. He's nervous, I think, right? Yes, sir. Maybe a little further back, but it's all it's all different up there. And you, I'm surprised that you're here, you know? I thought he's only the trainer for all these people. But now I see him here beside them. That's why I fully understand he's screaming, he's worrying about their lives, their discipline, you know. So it's so logical to teach them properly how to against the enemy. Go. We're not in Kansas anymore, Dorothy. It's raining. It's bloody raining. Huh? 
They're on an open space, I guess. They can see you all together. I see a lot of dead people. Oof. Yeah, you... Oh, no. And with the rat don't scream. <laughs> What's going on? What's going on? Stop screaming. Oh no, my goodness. <laughs> it was like a signal for all of them. I can't see nothing. I can't see it at all. It's somewhere. Oh. <laughs> See them. Come on, we, we, we get you on the cover. Come on, come on, <laughs> It's so hard, guys. It's so hard. <laughs> Is that one? Not alone to shoot. No, 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 it's dead, man. All right, let's go. It's a trap. Who's that? Oh no. Oh no. They're all together. Fire. Behind you, right behind you. Stay away, stay away. Thank you. You are going, find someone. Give me a shot of morphine and move on. Morphine and move on. What does it mean? You want to leave him here? Please, please, please don't. Please don't leave me. I'm gonna get you home. I'm gonna get you home. Stretch, stretch off. He's afraid. He can't move. Can't move it. Oh, granite! Get out of here! Back. He's okay, he's alive. Come on, keep going, keep going. We're gonna get you home. The sweetest words I think in the place we're gonna get you home. Uh, we can't see them and they can't see us neither. I think they can see you guys. I don't know. Look at them. Here we go, here we go. Right is right. Come on now. You doing okay? He's fine, he's fine. The back. Okay. Can you see this hole? Try, try, try one more time. Right in a hole. Try to shoot that. Those holes are everywhere. Come on, stick. Cover! cover him. Can you cover him? Oh no, no, so close! Cover him there. I think he's still alive. Where is your hat? Please put it on. Good job. Go! Yahoo! Just took their lives, you know, guys. Put your hand on it. It's crazy, guys. Woo! It's full of the pressure and it's it really makes sense. I'm gonna burn everything. Are you, hit? Uh, you got a bump on the head, that's okay. What's your name? 
Andy Walker. You know, also know that? Ghoul. Ghoul. Good job, man. Good work. Dig in for the night. We hold this spot. Find yourself a nice, safe hole. And he's still alive. Great to see you alive. Out there, heads down, asses lower. I don't care if you need to take a piss or a dump. Where the hell are you going, Dom? Still more wounded out there, sorry. I'll go with him. Be smart. Keep your ears down. All right, let's find a spot. Good that he has this friend now. Nellie and Henry dead in the first 15 minutes. Peterson, Popeye, Paige and Hunger, Ralston. In peace, sons bury their fathers. In war, fathers bury their sons. You want to stop spouting that crap, huh? And don't help none. Yeah, you got that right. Not here. Only praying, guys. I think only praying. Give me that. Hey, this man's gonna need some plasma. Yeah. Can you believe it? All these people were waiting for them till night. Should we find a home to dig in? Not good to me. You ain't gonna eat them. I don't eat meat. Help yourself. What do you eat? On the veggies, I think, right? That's one heck of a dame. You know you're fighting out of your weight class with her, don't you? <laughs> yes, I do. <laughs> don't tell her that. I'm an asshole sometimes. Sometimes? <laughs> sometimes? Great to hear it finally, you know, not that you asshole, that you feeling sorry. Oh, rats, they're eating these dead bodies. These jabs are sneaky. I'll take first watch and you get some shut eye. You want to sleep here? The rocket. Get ready for the next way. <gasps> The dream, right? It was a dream. But it was so tough. That was a dream. Dream to got my soul skewered. I can't do nothing. Rifle's just here. It won't bite. Yeah, it will. After what we just been through, any sane man would be screaming for a weapon. My daddy's a drunk. He fought it for years, but it kind of got a hold of him hard and made him mean. Your mama raised you? But she gave me to an orphanage when I was five. Oh my gosh, all of them, they have different stories. But now they judge people quicker, and I got you very wrong. My daddy used to beat me and my brother just because the sun rose and then whip us just because it said. I could take that. But when he would do it to our mama. Oh my god, oh my god. Stop it, stop! See? Can you see his eyes? But you didn't kill him. In my heart, I did. Because he was thinking about that. It means something. Can you see this crazy situation? Can you imagine now something like that? But I ain't never gonna touch a gun again. After that, I thought because of this story with his brother, almost killed his brother, that's why he rejected. Just awaken. Still a lot of people, guys. I'm hearing these bullets flying. It's right behind me. Oh my god. Such a realistic shooting. I don't think so. That you have enough power, guys. You don't have enough people for this fight. Don't expect to be here much longer. It's everywhere. Please be careful, because they're gonna kill you now. Oh! <laughs> Can you hear all their voices? Oh my goodness! No! It can't move at all. See? Pressure on it. Don't need plasma. Get over there. Go. Medic is wanted, guys. We need more hands. Can you help yourself? No plasma. No, right here. You cannot die. Hold together. No. I didn't know that you can only throw this thing. They're coming, they're coming, and on, and on, and on, and on. I like this boy. Especially. Here we go. Oh. Get and a shoulder. 
I know, I know, I know, I know, they're just scared. No, don't, don't, don't you do that! Don't die, don't die, don't die! You gotta move! Oh my goodness, guys, oh guys! This boy is so skinny, guys, but he's still so strong. Let me get him down! Let me get him down! Come on, let's move! Come on! He's gone! He's gone? No! We gotta get out of here! Oh no, he's dead, guys! We get him back! What about the commander? Do you remember? I think he's still there. What is it you want of me? I don't understand. I can't hear you. Help me. All right. I get goosebumps, guys. I'm worrying about him. Oh. The bomb in this place. And all along, he was just helping these people and. Ah. Right with Ford, how many? 32 only came down, sir. Let's load them up. It's so dangerous being here, boy. Here we go. Here's Desmond. We, we gonna fix you up. You stay here, keep watching, keep your eyes peeled for Jack. No, but the... Help. Another Help. man. I got you. Put your hand on. Keep pressure on. Only you is helping. You are helping all these people. I don't see another medics. One of them wanted, and third one. Alright, almost done, almost done, almost done, almost done. Is it possible? Oh, do you remember this thing? Okay. This is gonna work. I'll get you dressed up in a jiffy. It's falling down, guys. Look at that. Look, 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 look. All right, another one. Careful, careful. Oh my gosh, look at this harm. It's all these people. It's pure hero, guys. I think you're gonna find another people. The artillery attack on Hacksaw. Still over a hundred men left up there. Tell them to call off the artillery on Hacksaw. I'll get you a drink. And he's still here. We just lost our cover. <gasps> no, they're coming right up. They're coming right up. They stop this. They just keep coming, brother. I got this. No behind you! They're coming right up. Do you have any rifle? Do you have any gun or something like that? They could hear you guys. You don't know if your men up there are dead or alive. You can't go back up there with that room. Can you see that? He's just delivering this man. Any fresh men, okay? I don't have any troops. Take more than a day to get men in here. I need them faster than that. What about this man? How is it possible? He's alone here. Wow, he's on the tunnel. Good for you that you found this place. Shh. They're over there, they'll be base. Haha, <laughs> they can't see you. You're still alive. Look at them. Oh no, he's trying to help him as well. You know, he's absolutely right, guys. They're breathing. Oh. Who's 
that? Who is that? Stop, stop, stop shooting! Lily, Lily, oh, be quiet. Are you in? Be quiet, just be quiet. I got you. Try that, try that. I thought it was blind. I thought it was blind. Oh, look at this smile. Get out of here. Come on. Guys, somebody can catch you. Be careful. Could be behind you. Please take a look. Yeah, we got you. Don't die, don't die. Help me get one more. Ah, uh, he's tired. He's exhausted. Help me get one more. And this music, guys. Help me get one more. Oh my gosh. How many people he saved? I thought they pulled out. Not all of them. I'm nuts up there dragging wounded from the top. Even lowered a couple of japs. I'm back with you directly. All set. Move out. One or two. Come on, come. Get in here. There's nips everywhere. Scared nothing if not for surprise. Are you still here? I thought it saved your life. I didn't see the face and I thought this is you. How's this? Ah, let me see. It looks much worse than it is. The girls will still won't kiss you. You okay here for a while? I'm coming back. Let's go. You and me, come on. Oh my gosh, I hope you have enough time to come back and pick Soldier up. I hope so, you have enough time. Please stay alive. Oh yes. something you gotta see. Our guys have been coming down in droves all night. Come on, follow me. He's right here. How you doing, sir? Hey, Cap. Hey, Cap, they're alive. Oh, my gosh. Good oh. to see you, kid. Come on, Dos. Dos. Dos did this. Dos did this. Dos did this. Dos. Dos the coward. Dos, come back, please. Come back. We need you. Stay where you are. Get up. But they can see you. They could see you. Bring it on. See them? Did you see the snipers? No? Oof. Here we go. Good job. Thank you. You're like I'm on a shoe, ain't you? Give it. It's a bit late for target practice now, don't you think? Do you want to use it? No? You're kidding. I'm gonna drag you. Let's do it. Come on, come on, come on! Let's go! So, look at them! Oh my god! So good, keep going! Keep moving! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Get up! Woo! Get it down! They're gonna kill you now, boy! But please get down. Sergeant now. Doss is still up there. He's got chaps on his tail. Oh, he found another man. He's still alive, I guess, right? Oh, yeah. to help him. Fairly can stay. <laughs> he needs some rest, definitely. Are you wounded? Mm. Let's get this soldier to a hospital tent right now. Look at all these people. They're observing. They're watching them. As a hero. Okay, I think you want to take a look at these people. Reserve. Give me a check to their medic. He didn't make it. He died of shock. No plasma. Sorry. Look at you guys full of butt. I 
I'm so proud of him. Help this enemy who's wanted, right? You've done more than any other man could have done in the service of his country. And I've never been more wrong about someone in my life. I hope one day you can forgive me. Forgive me? We have to go back up tomorrow. Tomorrow is your Sabbath. Most of these men don't believe the same way you do. But they believe so much in how much you believe. And what you did on that ridge is nothing short of a miracle. It's pure miracle, guys. It's pure miracle. He's a miracle. And they're not going to go up there without you. God was talking to you through his help. I'm supposed to begin that assault 10 minutes ago. Waiting for what? Private Doss is praying for you. They're praying. It's really important, guys. I fully agree with you. Good to go. I guess all these men were praying with just. Oh man, why are you killing each other? The underground, right? The underground, they know. Oh yes, right back. Oh my gosh, without suits. No, this is a trap. Get Look at them. Oh no. Okay. We're gonna find it. Something else? He's gonna kill himself. They're all together. Oh, yes. I know this. Oh, it's so hard. We've taken an axe off. Hold up! Hold up! Wow. How are you feeling? This isn't my guess, right? It's real man. Can you believe it? His wife. I was just kept praying the Lord. Toss this you, 20 of 3. When I got this, I said, pray, Lord, please help me get one more. Oh my gosh. I would say anyone is wrong to try to get with this army. When you're under conviction, that is not a joke. That's what you are. Even though I said those things to him in regard to carrying a rifle, then he would never be my by my damn side. Then uh, in the long run, he was one of the bravest persons alive. And then to have him end up saving my life was the irony of the whole thing. This is him. <laughs> He's really old now. Saw his face and eyes. Great. Just laying there, just groaning, called for medic. And when I blood was washed from his eyes, his eyes came up. I thought I was blind. <laughs> he says, I thought I was blind. <laughs> oh, yes. Anything more to warn that smile he gave me, I'd have been well repaid. 87. Hmm. March of 2006. Okay, guys. It was such a beautiful movie, and I got a lot of feelings while watching this one. I fully agree with the idea of Mel Gibson, and uh, I'm so appreciated for his incredible protagonist. It's a real story and I really love this beautiful man who's trying to save different lives. It doesn't matter what side belongs to some soldiers. He doesn't want to take any lives. Yeah, do you remember, for example, his help to a Japanese soldier who was wanted? Yes, he's a pure hero. He's a pure good man. I hope we can have more men like that in the, our life. It was so good. It was so great to you see a lot of people like that and good book can help everywhere i believe it because it was really important for these soldiers before the fight just 
take a break and pray. Probably it was their last moment being alive. Yes, yes, yes. I'm really impressed and I'd like to take a look at something else. Can you please suggest me my next reaction? I'd be so, so, so appreciated. Sometimes I even didn't know what to say because I was only watching and dive through this atmosphere. Unfortunately, I couldn't show you everything here on YouTube channel. That's why you can join me on my Patreon page and take a look at, this, at the full movie reaction. Or also you can get a vlogged video and you can choose different movies in the future and take a look at the bunch of movies which I already uploaded. Okay guys, thank you, thank you, thank you and see you next video. Bye!